Welcome to Complete FTP Server Free Edition. This uh, video is a, just a brief overview of the free edition, how to install the basic setup. To start installing, double click on the installer executable and you'll get to the setup wizard dialog box. Click on next and the first thing you'll see is the licensed agreement. If you're satisfied with that, click I agree. Install location, which you can choose, default is easiest, default start menu folder, and then installation begins. We'll next be prompted for the admin user's password. The admin user is how we log on to the server as an administrator. I'm going to show the characters to make it easy to enter the password. And Password is not recommended for abduction machine, of course. A few settings are set up there. You'll notice that uh, SSH keys are generated. The free edition doesn't support SSH or SFTP, but it does support upgrading to these at a time in the future. So, what you can do is anytime you choose, after installing the free edition, you can purchase an upgrade to another edition that supports these protocols. And the keys are already generated for you. If installation is complete, we'll run the manager when finished. Connect to the server and this will bring up the complete FTP manager. I won't add any users just now. So the complete FT manager offers full control over the server configurations. We've shown the overview panel to start with, which shows the protocols, FTP, unencrypted, FTPS, encryption over SSL or TLS, and FTPS implicit mode, which is also over SSL TLS, but it's a special legacy mode that is still occasionally used. No users yet, a few default folders. There is a link to activate the server, activate the free edition, because when you first install the free edition, it's in trial mode. It's completely free to activate the free edition, of course, but you need to do that at some point during the trial period. If I show the full menu, you see it's still the overview, some more detailed settings there which show the protocols and well, as you drill down to more protocol, uh, protocol settings. Users, click on here to add a user, to set up the folder structure, monitoring the server, some real-time logging, look at log files, Admin access and finally licensing. You click on activate free edition. This is where you get to to activate. You'll notice at the moment it's unactivated and the expiry date is 15th of August. You can compare editions by clicking on this link, it takes you to our site. And you can also switch to other editions if you want to compare them. Standard edition, OK. Upgrade, we're now in the standard edition. You see, we now need to purchase instead of activate for free and apply the purchase license. But we can also, in trial mode, switch back to free. So, the features that aren't available in free, download and apply changes, and we're back to the free edition. So, you can switch to any of these editions to take a look at them and then downgrade back to the free edition. Activate here. So that gives you a brief overview of complete FTP free edition. We'll have some more detailed videos later on that explain some of the more detailed settings.